Hey everybody, Tuesday at Sun and Fun. I'm Greg from Vans Aircraft. We have Trevor here from Behringer USA. That's Is right, that right? that's yeah. right. So we have some kind of cool news to announce um, about our RV10 and RV14 kits. An option to use Behringer wheels and brake system. So uh, the wheels, the brakes, the hoses, the whole nine yards. That's right. We really got to thank the customer base for pushing this up to the OEM. It's a, it's a fantastic option. Uh, Behringer wheels and brakes uh, paired with pre-made brake lines coming out of aircraft specialty. Uh, it's, it's the simplest option for putting wheels and brakes on your aircraft. Uh, you know, we really focus on the safety improvements of tubeless tires. Um, our entire brake package system is, is excellent and uh, we're looking forward to seeing more Vans customers hop on. Yeah, so we know we know that um, using the Behringer system on the RV10 and the RV14 and even some other airplanes, right? That's right. For now, we're working on RV10 and RV14. So sometime in early April, early to mid-April, on our order forms, you'll see that we'll be adding the Behringer option uh, to the order forms. You'll be able to choose that. And at that time, please don't call and ask ahead of time. If you can wait a couple weeks, it'll really be better. We'll also have information that we'll send out and provide about how if you already have something on order and you want to make a change, don't worry, we're going to take care of you. Please don't call our orders team and ask. They're really, really busy, and a lot of our people are here, not back there answering the phone. Right. So that's for the orders team. So, Same for us. But give, if you, give us a while to get back home. <laughs> give, us, give us a chance. We will be communicating information about when it goes on the order forms for people who are ordering kits new, as well as anybody that might have a kit on order if they want to take that option. What do you say we go over to your booth and we can take a look at the actual equipment? Maybe you can maybe you can show it to folks and explain a little bit about it. Let's do it. All right. All right, Trevor, so what do we have here? All right, so we get a lot of questions from folks asking, you know, what's different about Behringer wheels and brakes? And I think the best way is just to show folks. So, as you can see, our wheels and brakes are quite a bit different from the competition. You've got a floating disc. Everything that's uh, associated to the brake package stays mounted to the aircraft. The teeth of the disc engage into these grooves. So when you put it back on, you have to make sure that these the disc lines up with the wheel. And then you add in a safety wire when you're done so that you have an added level of protection. Uh, all of our wheels are designed for tubeless tires. So you've got a threaded valve stem, no more tubes. Uh, and then we sell the package with master cylinders and an optional parking brake. Uh, we've partnered with Aircraft Specialty to do the brake lines, pre-made brake lines, which makes the install incredibly easy. Uh, we sell it for the aftermarket uh, folks uh, with our own brake lines. That's a cut and assemble type of situation. But uh, for anybody that's building in the RV for the first time, this is a huge time saver and simplifies the entire install. So one more option we have for pretty much any aircraft with wheel pants. You know how hard it is to get down there and check your tire pressures and it's something you need to be doing. We've come out with Sensair, which is a tire pressure monitoring system that lives inside the tire. So it doesn't integrate into the valve stem. It mounts inside the wheel and it talks via Bluetooth to an app on your smartphone. So it makes checking your tire pressures uh, incredibly easy. You just hop in, get close to the aircraft, open up the app, and then uh, you've got your tire pressures of, of all three tires right there. All right, so check back. Early April time frame, you'll get you'll see that the uh, price sheets, advanced aircraft, the order forms, I should say, will be updated with uh, the new options for the RV10 and the RV14. People are going to ask, what about RV7, RV8, RV9? Give us a little time. We're working on that together. I think we've been trying to figure some of that stuff out, uh, one little step at a time. But uh, we hope that this is an option that people building the 10s and the 14s will look forward to, and uh, let us know what you think. Absolutely, appreciate your time, Greg. See ya.